Oh, there he is! Oh boy! <laughs> Give me some love. All right. I am Dave Dilford. I am the uh, uh, the former CEO of Defy Media. Used to be this guy's boss. I used to run Smosh. But, you know, at Defy, we really defied expectations. Um, and unfortunately, we also defied our investors. And so... I hate how much you nailed the shirt. Uh, okay. Well, I think what attracted me to Smosh was, you know, I, I saw Smosh as just this, it was so funny. I feel like the whole motto that Smosh gave off was, you know, growing up is weird. And I felt like... We needed something that had a demo of, you know, seven or eight year olds. And I really wanted to hone in on, on making, making giggles for eight year olds. And I feel like we really did that. I feel like we really made some giggles for eight year olds. This is legit triggering. <laughs> well, when, we, when I first met you, you know, because I took over as CEO, I remember you guys were writing in the, in the writer's room. I came by and I just was like, I was like, hey, you know, I, I, uh, I'm pretty funny. And I was like, what if we did a sketch where maybe, you know, Ian, you're on rollerblades, but you don't know how to rollerblade, so it's just, maybe it's 10 minutes of you just kind of, ah. No, I think you suggested an elephant. I did suggest an elephant. You know, what if we have maybe, you suggested an what, elephant. If, what if Shane was talking to an elephant? Yeah. And then we had speech bubbles for what the elephant was saying back. Uh, that's something I actually did pitch. Yeah. <laughs> that's something that I said to your face. <laughs> we ran out of money and didn't tell anyone that until they were getting fired. So that's when they found out and um, but that's, you know, I think that's, like I said, growing up is weird. Every moment at Defy was my favorite moment. That's how it was for me, and I think that's how it was for, for everyone else. You know, it was like a sailboat, or, you know, more like a big boat, like the Titanic. Great analogy. Yeah. The thing is, Ian, I think it's time for us to start a new company together. I think we should collab again, and, and we, maybe we can make a, a, a business that'll go viral. Oh. I have some cards here. Oh, uh, okay. So, if you wanna. Yeah, sure. Um, <laughs> what are some cool hip names for our new company? I was thinking, you know, Defy sounded nice, but it wasn't cool. Yeah. You know, it wasn't legit. Yeah. And which made, made me think maybe legit media. Or, you know, we're trying to, we're trying to appeal to a certain demographic, teen media. Medea goes to jail. <laughs> <laughs> Where would our HQ be? Um, I'm thinking maybe uh, Times Square, uh, the Las Vegas Strip, someplace with rent that's astronomical. But here's the fun tip, you don't have to pay it. <laughs> <laughs> um, the last question that you, that you wrote yes. on here, it just says, you are extremely cool. <sighs> Thank you, Ian. That means a lot for you to say. Your tears were more believable when the company went under. <laughs> I would say keep it real. And, you know, uh, uh, shut, shut up. It's been so nice to see you. Yes. Oh, and that's a wrap. Great. Most legit. Oh, there he is. Oh boy. <laughs> Give me some love. All right. I am Dave Dilford. I am the, uh, uh, the former CEO of Defy Media. Used to be this guy's boss. I used to run Smosh. But you know, at Defy, we really defied expectations um, and unfortunately, we also defied our investors, and so... I hate how much you nailed the shirt. Uh, okay. <laughs>